So this bus station is alive in that normally you would have to look for a bus if it's coming. But this bus station tells you actually that the bus is coming. So you can chill out, you can lean in one of those pods and just be really relaxed. You can even close your eyes and then you will hear a sound when the bus is coming and you will also, when you look at the ceiling, you will see the colors of the bus line that is actually coming. The project started with uh, a question to design a bus stop of the future that was smart and also very environmentally friendly. We sort of reframed the sustainability question there because we felt we could make a much bigger impact to the environment if we can, in the long term, make the use of public transportation very attractive, more attractive than taking cars. We live in a very technological time where we spend a lot of time on computers and working with data, and it's very mind-driven in a way. And in that, that sort of like way of thinking, we often forget what we can actually do with our bodies. It's also really good to do stuff with the body and to solve problems with the body, let's say. And that's what I try to do in my design projects. We want to see this uh, bus stop as a prototype that hopefully will spark a conversation among the people that will use it. But I also hope that this, as a research project, contributes to the knowledge in the field of mobility. And hopefully that knowledge will be used in the future uh, in building more intelligent cities, which is not necessarily just more technological, but it's more intelligent in the sense that they will serve uh, humans and nature in a better way, in a more sustainable way. <laughs>